Hello, I'm Dr. Chaos, and welcome back to Hitman. This time we're doing the Hitman 3 missions. So let's start us off with the story so far. Cinematic. Agent 47 and Diana Burnwood are the world's top assassins working for the ICA. Unknowingly, they have been hired by a shadow client to target a number of operatives of Providence, a secret organization working in the highest echelons of power. Providence's controller, the Constant, approaches Diana and makes her a deal. Eliminate the shadow client and learn about 47's past. But when 47 discovers that the shadow client is Lucas Gray, his lost childhood friend, he and Diana switch sides to fulfill an old pact. Destroy Providence. Together, they manage to capture the Constant, forcing him to reveal the identities of the three Providence partners. Eliminate them, and the war would be over. However, the Constant has an ace up his sleeve. Which, if you guys remember from last episode, is basically the fact that he is now in control of their assets. And by the way, Death in the Family, um, that is based on Wives Out, if I understand it. But we're going to Dubai anyway. Look closer. In the shadows. Behind the everyday world. Beyond the headlines and the seats of power, a hidden hand. A kind of company known as Providence. To it, we were just assets to use and throw away, to do the unthinkable. The unforgivable, and it never gave us a second thought until now. After decades in the shadows, we are fighting back. Me and 47. Much has been lost, but we are closer than ever. We trapped the Constant, Providence's chief controller and finally learnt the names of its three partners. Before you got away. In their downfall, we lay the past to rest. And, just maybe, look towards the future. 37. It's time. The partners are down there. You know, I never planned this far ahead. You never do. I see someone got his memory back. Wait, is that a beacon? That was close. What the hell? Base. Alexa Carlisle's helicopter just took off. Confirm target locations. Over. Diana, what's the status? Right. We have a situation. Carlisle has left the building. And I think I know why. The Constant has escaped. He persuaded one of the sailors into setting him free. And since then, he's been seizing control of Providence assets and resources. I can only assume Carlisle is rushing to contain the damage. If she slips away again... We'll keep track of her. Make sure she doesn't. Meanwhile, the plan stays the same. Your destination is the Scepter, the world's tallest building where the partners are laying low, courtesy of their host, Sheikh Omar Al-Ghazali. Marcus Stuyvesant is fifth generation old money. His family made its fortune in real estate and banking and were at one point the chief landowners in New York. 
Carl Ingram is a powerful Washington kingmaker whose family grew rich selling gunpowder during the American Civil War and later established a globe-spanning empire in oil, coal, and steel. Both families long since retreated from public view, but their quiet dominance endures to this day. Now, the partners likely suspect that we're coming so Mr. Gray will infiltrate building controls and disable all electronic doors and elevators. Stuyvesant and Ingram are about to find they have nowhere left to run. Right. This is our moment, 47. Providence ruined our lives with the flick of a pen. Today, we return the favor. Sorry, look at Happy the hunting. With more than a flick of a pen. Sorry about that. So yeah. Can't bring in a concealed weapon. Oh, that's because um Oh. That's the direct interesting. I have no idea what that means. But yeah, eventually, eventually I can get other stuff. Um, smuggled item in. Can't smuggle anything in. And gear-wise, yeah, go for the lock pick. Could be a lot more useful. I presume that's just what I is what I just went through. So let's start. So I have a lockpick, but that's it. Couldn't conceal a gun on my um skydiving suit, huh? Welcome to Dubai, 47. Today is the inauguration of the Scepter, and the ceremony is well underway. You will find Marcus Stuyvesant near the building's signature art installation. While a paranoid Carl Ingram has ensconced himself in his penthouse suite, security on highest alert. Mr. Gray is already in position and ready to assist. Good luck, 47. Ooh. Alright, this is where he's... 47. Come in. 47, do you copy? I'm here. Are you in position? I'm heading towards the point of entry. Good. Get back to me when you're there. Right, so where? I assume it's going to be down there, but... Okay, yeah, uh, I think it is... down there. And I'll probably just go to someone... well... I'll actually go to someone 5, but I'll get to someone who'll find a little lot more. Seven, use your camera and scan the lock, will you? I think I can override the window's controls from here. Okay. Now to go into the event. I'm in position. 47, the inauguration is taking place close by. Once you've infiltrated it, get your bearings. I'm sure there must be floor plans somewhere. Understood. We need absolute focus on this one. If Ingram and Stuyvesant are alerted to our presence, we may lose them for good. Ooh, coin? We are so coin. close, 47. Don't worry. They're not going anywhere. Do I not get a map? Or oh, do I get a map? That is annoying. I 
Okay, that... Okay, that was cool, though. Wait, I can go back and just... Oh, it's on the... Yeah, oh, that's... that's funny. I want to talk to the partners directly. Make them understand why all of this is happening. And that terminal gives me an idea. There's a server room near the Sheikh's personal reception. If you can gain access to it, we might be able to recover useful intel for you. will have to work together to hack the system, but it's our best. They just decided to, um... It looks like the staff area could provide you with a viable route to the server room. So they just decided to close it and cut this out. There's a keypad lock on the doors to the staff area. One moment. All right, try this. Four, seven, zero, six. There's quite a bit of security here. One moment. You ready for some more fresh air, 47?
gonna say she's a puppy dog or anything. I think I can open that window remotely. Scan the lock with your camera and I'll have a try. Sheikh Al-Ghazali is reaching out to his worldwide network of lawyers and financial contacts, attempting to restore the lost power base of the Providence Partners. If Ingram and Stuyvesant were asked to a meeting, thinking they'll be told of new developments, I suspect they'd jump at the chance. There's a lounge area at the top of the building. It can be sealed off for private conversations. If we lure the targets there, they'll be trapped. the also casual adventure staff just climbing up the side of the building. So yeah, as this is kind of a tutorial mission, like the general tutorial mission for Hitman 3, um, there is going to be some railroading with this mission. The server room should be behind one of the doors in this hallway. Let's face it, that's not going to bring anyone here. Oh, shit, I must go and get the, um, uh, from the, 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 what did I say? I was going to get... ah! can use this to summon the partners to a fake meeting, 47. All right, I'm no hacker like Olivia, but I think you need to pull one of the racks here to gain access to the terminal. Damn it, a silent alarm is being 
security is on its way. Hide for the... Seven. I'm allowed to be in here. So that's hide, but do I really need to? Can I kind of just hang around? Down. Okay. Yes. Sorry about that, 47. Let's try again, shall we? Ah, I think I've got it. We'll need a key card to gain access. Someone in maintenance should have one we can borrow for a spell. Blood on my hands. I've never taken things to such an extreme before. Uh, yes. I promise I'll start attending anger management. This way. Might as well have a little bit of a look around. No, I do wish these maps were well, not the ones you can get in Freelancer, but I do not believe you can. I could be wrong, hope I'm wrong. have done something. Can you see anything different in the room? Um. Not really. No. Uh, this one's yellow, actually. Good. We're in. Now all you need to do is access the terminal and use the calendar option to summon the Providence partners to a meeting. Building cameras are now disabled. Elevator doors are now open. has been booked. The partners should be moving up here shortly. Huh. Looks like the lounge can be sealed off for private conversations. Handy. Excellent. I see the partners moving. You should join their meeting. Time to end this, 47. Cameras are showing a lot of guards up here. They wouldn't suspect one of their own. Then come in here. Give me a break. Right in here. Now I can. 
dikeluarkan I could just go up there, but how does it want me to? Hello. Oh, and it just like Hello, that. Sir. Okay, then might as well just. So the thing is, I have the lock picks at Anno, so... Oh yeah, just the lock picks, really important. No one's around, so... The partners are alone now. I'll activate the panel controlling the room's security features. When you're ready, use it to start the show. what I can pick up on my way through as well. What's this? Is this like make bed or lion bed or something? Yeah, make bed. Down. Why can you go up even further? Oh no, just another way down. Sir, what are you doing here? Oops. Namaste. Not another step. That was completely my own fault. Hey, you, please stop. Well, that just Where 
is he? Where's the Sheik? It's a busy day for him. Surely we can give him a few moments. Do you know what he wants to talk about? No. What's this? Carl? Did you do that? I certainly did not. I have no idea what's going on. Gentlemen, what's the meaning of this? You... you're the one responsible for all this. Gray, what do you want? Something that has been a long time for you. Revenge. Revenge? How but now? You killed Cobb, Nanakov, Caruso, the Washington twins, everyone, and David. You broke into our bank. And you outed Providence to the world. Whatever perceived slight we've done to you is insignificant to the amount of damage you've caused us. You've caused the world. You're a murderous terrorist. Nothing more. What did we ever do to you anyway? You specifically? Nothing. Providence? Everything. Providence made me. And at the flick of a pen, Providence broke me. I'm just returning the favor. Providence has ruined the lives of countless people, expecting and facing no consequence for its actions. You take for yourselves and those who support you, and you burn everyone and everything else to the ground from the comfort of the shadows. No more. You're delusional. Exposing us achieved nothing beyond moving a few pieces around on a board much more complicated than you can fathom. The world believes we're dead. What more do you want? Me? Nothing. My friend, however, well, let's just say he's a bit of an expert. I'm just here to watch you die. 47, finish it. 47. What the? Finish it. Finally, Stuyvesant and Ingram are gone. Providence will soon be no more than a bad memory. 47. Thank you. I'll meet you at the rendezvous on the edge of town. Just gonna dump the corpses in case... They do come in, I mean, yes, there is the blood splatter and the bullet holes, but apart from that, no one will know a thing. And eventually if they do look in there, they'll find the corpses. Get out of here. 
and back into a skydiving scene. which is a new stash, a new starting, and a new melee weapon. If that's your winning face, I'd hate to see you lose. We underestimated the Constant. Yeah, he's a glorified desk clerk. He's not just after the money. He wants it all. We caught him once, we can do it again. And, well, we're not the ones who let him escape. You still don't trust her. I don't like executive decision makers. Look, you don't have to follow her, you know? Soon, this will be over. Maybe it's time to think about the future. You have to face the possibility that there's no going back. If the ICA knows what you did... She'll make it right. She always does. We have a fix on Carlisle. Come on. We've got a plane to catch. I hope you like the rain, 47. Miss Burnwood. How did you... I have everyone's number. You really ought to know by now. You planned this. All of it. Don't be silly. I just played the hand I was dealt. We'll find you. You had me. Where'd that get you? We handed you an empire. It's for the best. The partners were complacent, set in their ways. But power is more than just security. Providence can be an agent of change. Surely you understand. Or you will. Soon enough. Right. That's that. I'll see you all next time. Bye. Goodbye.